When you look at these pictures, you might be wondering, why do these people have their hands down their pants? Well, it's actually an effort to support an Aurora Marine who was injured while stationed in Hawaii. 7 News reporter Matt Zitzman spoke with him, his friends and family, about what they're calling the hands down your pants challenge. From his Hawaii hospital bed, 20-year-old Marine Alec Mosenor Jimenez describes the moment he lost most of his right-hand fingers in a mortar training accident last month. I started spurting out blood out of my hand and everything, and it just it looked something like out of like a scary movie. Doctors told Alec he needed a live skin graft. They told me all the skin was off of my thumb. They attached his thumb to his groin, so he's had to keep his hand down his pants, so to speak, for three weeks until the graft takes hold. We're just trying to keep him positive and, you know, our silly little, uh, you know, hands in your pants for Alec thing is just fun. In a goofy show of solidarity, his girlfriend Lindsay started posing with her hand down her pants. Family and friends just ran with it. Well, my dad brother actually started it back in Colorado and, you know, we had no idea that this many people would be posting all these pictures from his fellow Marines. It's just amazing to see my core, my core family being there supporting me to doctors and nurses. It's fun for us because, you know, it's just one more thing we get to do in this room. Uh, seeing all the pictures come in of baseball teams, <laughs> volleyball teams. Alec now hopes to turn the hand down your pants challenge into a fundraiser for the nonprofit Wounded Warrior Project. And I just want to give back to the people who actually need it more than I do. So that other people have the opportunity when their soldier or Marine or whatever is in the same situation. This Marine still has more surgeries to go, but he's the one lifting everyone's spirits. Alec's always been incredibly positive about every situation. So, I mean, it's just who he is. Amanda Zitzman, 7 News.